What's up, guys? Too blunt in the building. All right, Too Blunt Army, I'm back in the building now. We just watched Fleur de Dis Diss Towards Kano. Now, this is the second half of the video. We're going to be watching Kano's Diss Towards Fleur de Dis, and let's see what Kano's talking about and rapping about on this one. Now, we're going to hop into this one. If you haven't seen the Fleur de Dis one, make sure you check it out. So, yeah, listen to both tracks and let me know in the comment section who you think won. So, down below, if you've already seen this, let me know who do you think won this little battle here between these two songs. So yeah, let's check out Kano F Fleur de D. You ain't real, you go in the fake foul. You make too much noise, you got a late style. Get all embarrassed, you on the stage, and I ain't seen nothing like that since eight mile. You see, we get dirty like then. It's okay. To this is hot in here. I'm sweating. Back ten. Nasty up in here. See? I did retaliate. You heard me on raw mission. To hear me on Deja now. Yeah, yeah, you ain't real, you go with a fake foul. You make too much noise, you got a late style. Get all embarrassed, you on the stage, and I ain't seen nothing like that since 8 Mile. You see, we get dirty like then. It's okay, you'll get burnt like a fence. We don't play, that's for certain, my friend. I'm K.A., so let me hurt him again. You think you're right, you're a Ken. You don't write words, I should buy you a pen. I'll put you one side and again, cause you're roaring like a lion again. You're roaring with K.A., and if you say K, can't flow, then you're lying again. Let me finish this pussy so I can get back to smiling again. Y'all say flirt as a pussy. Fuck it, I'm flirt and licks the pussy. Fuck it, how can they draw nice girls with noises? That's what I know, nigga. Wife's got a bucket. Flirt, I'll get up on the chuck it. Damn, damn. This is the last time on doing. It's nasty. Select a Mac 10. I'll tackle the studio crew. Yeah. I'll tackle Demon. Easy. Mad. Yo, 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 your air. You don't get props in east air. You don't get props in south air. You don't get props in north. Blur, yeah, your air. You don't get props in east air. You don't get props in north air. You don't get props in south. You tell them, yo, that's air. You don't get props in east air. You don't get props in north air. You don't get props in south. I suggest you to just watch your mouth. Ox demon, I can't bring arms out. I might get murked before I bounce. You can't rap it nasty, you'll be the worst in the camp in nasty, yeah. Well it's time to murk flirter, you know a head turner or a murker. You don't want the burner to burn ya, you'll never make it, never be a earner. A few months ago we never heard ya, play your volition, make sure you learn your lesson before you start taking it further. My niggas are like classic rock, don't murder, and I'll murder, flirt the diddy diddy. You're telling me you don't sound like diddy on stage trying to rhyme like diddy I put a flex in your rhyme like D. You could get a thousand reloads, you're not like D, and a crowd reaction, but not like D. Jeez! Left him, left him. Perkins, Perkins. Alright, before I get into this one, well, before I get into that one, this was Kano, F Fleur D. It was a diss track kind of mixed up, though. I don't know, it's like a live diss track or something like that. Wheel it up like two times or something. Uh, check it out. The link's in the description down below. I couldn't find a video for it, only uh, audio. So make sure you check that out. Now, before I say something about what he was saying, well, he was saying this. What happened between Fleur de D and Getz? He said Ghetto embarrassed him on stage worse than 8 Mile or something like that. I'm sure he's saying Ghetto as in Getz because I don't know any other Ghetto that's in the grime scene. So I'm sure he's talking about him. So what, was there something between Getz and Fleur de D as well? Like, did they have some kind of rap clash battle? I don't know. So yeah, let me know about that one if you know about it. Now, let's get back to these two diss tracks. I must say... Off the bat, Kano, his diss track was a lot clearer. You could hear more of what he was saying. However, Fleur de D had more of a complete diss track, in my opinion. I don't know if this is the correct one I'm listening to, but Fleur de D's diss track was a complete song, kind of, if you know what I mean. Because uh, he had more bars, he had more content, he said more things about Kano, he dissed Kano a bit more. So yeah, that aspect of it, he had a bit more bars. Kano's bars were clearer in my opinion, you can understand them more, but after listening back to Fleur de D and this, I don't have to listen back to Kano because everything was pretty clear and it was short, Kano didn't really go in. I don't know, it just felt like Kano didn't even take him seriously for some reason, it just sounded like he was just joking around like, who is this guy, who is this Fleur de D guy, and he's sending for me as if I care. Was Kano actually taking him serious or was he just like taking him as a joke or something like that because he didn't sound like he took him seriously. However, with that being said, 
I have to give this one to Fleur de D. So I think Fleur de D's, Fleur de D's track was more complete, uh, full, bars were better, flow was better, uh, in my opinion. Uh, so I would give him the edge, well, a bigger edge over Kano's this track towards him. I don't know if this is the correct one, but it's the uh, one of the only ones I could find. So yeah, what do you guys think about this one? Let me know in the comment section down below. I have to give this win to Flirt of D for this Clash Sunday between him and Kano, between these two songs that we just listened to. And if you haven't heard them both, go and check them out. The links are in the description down below. Listen to them back to back however many times you have to so you can decide which one you think was better and let me know which one you think was better let me know which one you think won between these two songs so yeah it's two blunt tv make sure you leave all of your favorite clashes in the comment section down below i will be checking them out and i will be doing a a clash a post clash review so i'm going to be going back to the songs or the people that i that clashed that i listened to already and do a re review of it because now that I have, I'm more familiar with the scene and more familiar with some of the terms that they were using, because when I listen to these diss tracks back, I'm like, wait, whoa, this one, this diss track is a little bit better than I thought it was before because I've learned uh, the scene a bit more, so their references make more sense. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna be going back and listening to some of the old diss tracks, and my opinions may change depend depending on the song. So yeah. I'm going to be looking back at the Bugsy Malone and Chip and the Skepta and Devilman. And I don't know which other classes I watch. I think those are the only two. So, yeah, I'm going to be doing that. So, yeah, it's Too Blunt TV. I'm out. Hopefully, you guys are having a good Sunday today. I'm at work right now. I don't want to be here uh, dealing with stupid customers, working, doing everyone else's job because they don't want to do their own jobs because sometimes you're the only person that has responsibility. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it's Too Blunt TV. I'm out.